What's up everyone, Arctic Hero, bringing you guys a brand new Running Ranked episode. This is Season 6, number 17 on Gears Judgment. Got three more episodes until the season ends, and today I'm bringing you guys information on that massive update. I'm sure if you guys have logged into Gears Judgment, things are a bit different. So, um, I, I watched Epic Games live stream right before they basically switched everything over, and... They pretty much implemented all they can from the wish list up until they can finish everything else out uh, with the title update. I don't know when the title update is coming, but I know it's going to be relatively soon based on how Jim kind of worded things. If you guys notice, I, I will mention this real quick. I am using the classic hammer burst. Uh, I will say that I played all ranked the last couple of days and uh, the classic hammer burst, man, it's, it's pretty difficult to use, especially against stacked teams because... The spacing is kind of like you want to use it like you would a lancer in that range, but uh, I mean I was just having trouble. It feels like the you have to lead your shots kind of like the Marksa, and the cadence is really weird. So um, I was really struggling, like go breaking even most of the time. Went negative a few games. Uh, this game I went pretty, uh, did pretty well, but uh, I just I uploaded this specifically for the torque bow play. Which you guys will see here in a bit. Uh, so anyway, that's that's on this gameplay. I'll talk about the classic camera burst in my next video. Uh, so let's get to this update. I, I guess one of the things that I first want to discuss is that the classic loadouts are now in every single playlist except for free for all. And from my understanding, and when I played execution, it wasn't an execution either. Uh, I don't know if that's going to change or not, but uh, it was not an execution. So those are the two uh game types traditional game types that do, do not have the classic loadouts ironically enough based off of all the feedback that we got like something like almost a thousand people gave feedback on this plus what was on the forums there were people that were logged in on on uh, epics forums and you know complaining that it's basically a rifle fest and that people are camping and setting up and you know if, if you run into teams anyway uh, uh i guess from my experience People were setting up before this was even implemented. I mean, you did have people running around with their Nash, but like setups were happening regardless. Uh, so I don't know. You know, people will, this is why, uh, designing by Facebook is not cool. Like <laughs> getting a bunch of feedback and, and doing that stuff is not always the best because you're not going to please everybody. Uh, so that's kind of why if you guys heard me on active reload, like I would rather Epic just stick with their guns and, and do what they're going to do than trying to go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Because people are going to complain no matter what is done. Uh, so I did notice that on the Epic forums before I proceed with this. So, ooh. Oh. Uh, so if anyone else, uh, if you're not liking the classic loadouts, man, I I, I don't know. I mean, I, this is what people ask for. So, um, boom shot has been reduced to two shots from three. The Bushka has also been reduced from six shots down to three. Um, so those are two pretty good changes. I think uh, the Bushka felt kind of spammy and the boom shot was just, you know, three is a little too much, I think, for the boom shot. So those are a little bit better. Um, and I feel like games uh, that I've played in so far, those weapons feel like more vital. Like when you have one, you're not just, you know, like I said, spamming it. Um the grenades are being removed. This is coming in the title update. The grenades ammo is being removed uh, from the pickups, the ammo pickups. So uh, when you pick up one of those, you will only get ammo. I believe, again, that is coming in a title update. Should help some with the nade spamming. And uh, Kim's head is being fixed. The headshot bug that you guys saw, I think Abraham uh, Abram's uh, version posted that. A while back, a female head fix on the boom shield is being fixed as well. I also believe that Abram posted that. Uh, there will be uh, the Lancer ammo reduction. I believe they're going to test that in the test server, what a classic or special event playlist, whatever. Um, you know, a lot of people over the years have kind of said that the, the Lancer has too much ammo in it. And this is, this is where it's probably going to get reduced. So we're going to get to see how it feels without uh, all the Lancer ammo in there. I think it's 60 rounds, so I don't know what they're going to reduce it to. Um, Stim has been removed from all game types except for free-for-all. 
Uh, there are more symmetrical maps that will be with the next DLC, according to uh, Jim. So they're going to be a lot more like Haven. Uh, that was, those were his exact words. So I'm hoping that will kind of pan out well. They're also going to try to fix some of the audio and visual issues. Uh, you know, a lot of people have kind of complained about COG on COG. Again, I'm pretty indifferent on it being COG on COG, but the audio issues, uh, if you guys have heard me in a couple videos now, I've kind of complained about the audio in this game. And Jim said that it's something with the Unreal Engine and having multi-leveled uh, design, it makes the audio kind of tricky in some places, but they are going to try to improve it. And they are going to try to improve visuals so you can distinguish friend from foe. Now, I haven't had trouble with the whole who's an enemy and who's not an enemy. So uh, if you're one of the people experiencing issues with that, hopefully the fixes that they have will improve that. A ranked has also been increased for the amount of experience points. I believe this is like one of my first or second games on. I started off at like 41 or 42. And by the end of the night, I re-upped. So I played like... I don't know, two hours of ranked and I was already done with the forties. It was like crazy fast. Uh, so that should be a little bit more incentive. I don't know if they're going to do anything else to get people in ranked, but, uh, uh, you know, I, I'm a big time ranked guy. This, this whole series is off of running ranked. So, I mean, I can't live without ranked guys. I can't do it. Um, the melee now I've had, I think it was Illy has been consistently posting on my videos and there's a couple other guys like, when is Epic going to fix the melee? I'm not playing this game unless Epic fix the melee. According to what Jim said, it doesn't seem like there's going to be anything else that they can do to the melee. They've all, they've reduced the damage. They've changed the timing on a bunch of different weapons. Um, he's, he, I mean, he basically said that they, they can, I guess the last resort would be adding arbitrary delays to everything, uh, even further. But at this point, I guess the only issue is the reverse two piece. But if you're using the classic loadout, like how on earth can anyone like manage to get in your face? You're rifling them. And then as they break a certain plane, you get a quick switch on your weapon to get to your shotgun. And then you blow them to bits. Like I, I got melee three times in TDM and I don't know how many games. So that's, I mean, in gears three, it probably would have been zero. Don't get me wrong, but I think people are starting to get out of that habit because I had people that would engage and then they get to a point and then they get their head blown off. And it was like, oh, I can't I can't run in anymore. I can't even get close. Um, other than that, prize boxes will be fixed. Uh, Pete did say that he's going to be working on the prize boxes. Um, I think he said he's going to make it so that the weapon skins appear in all of them. Uh, so they're just going to clean out your weapon skins. Uh, don't quote me on that. I feel like that's in the, the Epic Games uh, live stream. Now, I have the links down to the live stream and to the forum so you guys can check all of that. There was It's such a massive update. I can't hit it, all of it in this video. So um, links are down in the description. Links save lives. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And uh, big shout out to everyone that contributed to the wish list because you guys made a difference. Peace. If you guys enjoyed this, make sure to like the video and subscribe for future installments in the Running Ranked series.